Hey everybody, uh, welcome to my channel again. Uh, this is uh, Pop Media Production. I am Harold Bryant and today what I'm going to be talking about is Switcher Studio or the app on the iPhone uh, classification I guess is called uh, Rico Studio. Uh, there's three versions of this on the on the iTunes App Store. Uh, there's a free version which I've downloaded. There's a, an $11.99 version, $12 which I downloaded. Uh, right now I'm recording on the $12 one, the studio, it's called the Switcher Studio. Um, and it seems to be doing everything that I want to do, which is why I'm sharing this. I'm so excited about it. I, am, I just want to share it with everybody, particularly uh, my colleagues and uh, other people that I uh, am associated with that's in this business. So what happens now is I'm going to show you a picture of uh, what I've got set up right here. This is my iPad and here's my laptop. My iPad I have set up as a switcher. You have two options to make your phone or your iPad a switcher or a remote camera. So I'm using my iPad because it's larger. I can hold more cameras and uh, other assets like graphics and such in, in the iPad. So this is my switcher. The cameras are set up as remote cameras. So um, I'm going to split screen right here so you can see, uh, see me a little bit as I talk about what's happening here. What it does is you hook up your cameras and then you can switch in between those cameras if you want to. Um, taking it off of the live view and it's going to go into a solid. The other, op the other nice thing about it is I discovered you can actually hook up your uh, iPad. So I'm going to go to the iPad right now, or not my iPad, my uh, laptop. So hit my Mac laptop is right here. Now you see it scrolling right here. So I'm going to put it live now. I'm going live again with it so you can see uh, how that's working and I'm going to take split screen off again so when I switch back so anyway you see what's happening here uh, you're looking at what's on my laptop so if you had a tutorial uh, or you uh, have an event where um, multiple people are around and you want to use your laptop to share with them what's on your laptop. Let's say you have a PowerPoint presentation or you have a, a video that you want to share. Then you could do that. I'm switching between between all that. And it's... <laughs> you hook up to your cameras. Sorry if I'm a little excited about that. I didn't script this out. I'm just going right off the cuff with it just because I'm so excited. And it is kind of... Uh, except for any set up my studio right here to shoot all this and show you how it works. So I'm going to have a series of these. This, this is the first one, just to introduce you to it and give you a little heads up on what it is. The next one I'm going to talk about is uh, how the iPad function works. Um, so when I'm, uh, you can see here, the iPad is uh, the iPad has multiple menus on here, and uh, I'm going to show you how to break those menus down, how to use them, and uh, I hope to see somehow how like you can see my my laptop right here uh, I want to see if I can mirror my uh, iPad the same way so that uh, you can see exactly what's happening that's my next goal but so I'm gonna have a series of these to break down switcher studio um, going from the basics uh, because I'm learning this myself and just so excited about it um, I shot a short video to learn how to work I hooked up four iPhones and my iPad as a switcher use four iPhones for close-ups wide shots uh, of my wife doing a tutorial on how to needle felt and I'll put that in the link of the description so you can see how I switch between that um, so anyway this is switcher studio that I'm trying to demonstrate to you and my name is Harold Bryant with Pop Media Productions and have a good day leave your comments subscribe if you want so you can get updates on these new ones um, and I'll see you on the next video